Welcome to our film. This is a short film to introduce you to Welcome Intervention. Most importantly, it's a film for you and your colleagues and how together we can make hope construction materials an even safer place to work. Serious injury incidents are just the tip of the iceberg. For every serious injury incident in the workplace, there are on average another 10 less serious injury incidents, 100 incidents where plant or equipment was damaged, and between 600 to 1,000 near-miss incidents where no one was hurt and no damage was caused. How many of us have had an injury or near-miss at work? It's important to report all injuries, incidents and near misses so that we can investigate them and take action to stop them from happening again. But have you ever thought about what causes injuries and incidents? All injuries and incidents are caused as a result of unsafe conditions in the workplace or by people working in a way that puts their safety or the safety of their colleagues at risk. If we think of injuries, incidents and near misses as the tip of the iceberg, then the at-risk behaviours and unsafe conditions are the bulk of the iceberg, the bit under the water that we don't see. For every injury, incident or near miss, there are many more at-risk behaviours and unsafe conditions which are happening on our sites every day, most of which go unnoticed or unchallenged. Whether an at-risk behaviour or unsafe condition results in injury or harm is purely down to luck. If we allow the condition to remain or the behaviour to continue, next time we might not be so lucky. The best way to make sure an injury or incident doesn't happen is to intervene and correct the behaviour or make the condition safe and then take action to prevent it from happening again. Inevitably, from time to time, we will come across at-risk behaviour and unsafe conditions in our workplace. But it is how we respond to these that will make a difference. If each time we see an at-risk behaviour or unsafe condition, we personally intervene to correct it, it is one small step towards making our workplace safer. Remember, the journey toward our goal of zero harm culture is made up of many small steps. Big heavy ones on the bottom shelf. By working Top together, shelf. we can make a Little difference to achieve that goal. If I intervene, I can make my workplace a little bit safer. If my colleagues intervene, together we can make our workplace a lot safer. If we're all prepared to intervene, just think what we can all achieve. Each time you intervene, you are helping to shrink the iceberg under the water. And if we shrink the part under the water, the part sticking out of the water will also start to shrink. Which means fewer injuries, damage incidents, and near misses. Little goose. 
We want you to intervene if you see anyone working in a way that puts their safety at risk. We want you to intervene and make safe any unsafe condition you find in your workplace. We welcome your intervention. It doesn't matter whether you're a HOPE employee, service partner or visitor. We welcome your intervention. Tell us how you have made a difference and made your workplace safer by completing a welcome intervention card. If you are unable to intervene personally to correct a situation, please still report it. Together, we will make sure our workplace is an even safer place to work. Oh, yeah. oh, yeah. oh, yeah, no, nice one. Thanks, mate. Thanks, Pete. Yeah. Appreciate right. that. Cheers, mate. Oh, cheers, Pete. Thanks, mate. Appreciate that. Cheers, mate. Thanks. Thank you. Yeah, cheers, mate. See you later. Bye. Daddy! Daddy! <laughs> I welcome intervention. I want you to intervene. We thank you for your welcome intervention. We, we welcome, welcome intervention. intervention. My children thank you for your welcome intervention. We welcome intervention. We, we welcome, welcome intervention. intervention. We welcome intervention. We welcome intervention. We, we welcome, welcome intervention. intervention. Welcome intervention. It's a simple idea. It's a genuine idea. And it's a very powerful idea. You have the chance to make a welcome intervention to make a huge difference to you and your colleagues. Thanks for taking the time to watch our film. Just remember that we want you to intervene in order to make Hope Construction Materials an even safer place. Now let's hear from the people that really matter to you. Well, I wouldn't have a dad if he wasn't safe and also I think it's important that you keep yourself and all your mates safe because that's like, it's just the right thing to do. Or your head would crack open. Would it? Yeah. yeah. Like a walnut. Like a what? A walnut. A walnut? Right. So if my head was a walnut, what would happen? Well like, if you didn't have a helmet on, like your head is a walnut, like it's like your your head is the shell and yeah. then like your brain is like the nut inside it. That's good. Because you need oh, it. Yeah. What would happen if mummy didn't wear it? Uh, it would be silly. Um, because to protect his eyes. From wood shavings. He'd probably lose his eye. He would cough up. Sh wood shavings and you wouldn't breathe. Yeah. Just do that. Just like that? Yeah. He brings three sweets. You protect your fingers. Oh, yeah. Oh. Um, he'd come lose a few fingers or his hand. And what would happen if I didn't wear them? You'll get killed. Really loud noises to protect your ears and anything that goes inside your ears. It will really hurt if you didn't wear it. You cut, you, you hurt yourself. Would the gloves help you? Yeah. And wood shavings. <laughs> Don't mess with the wood shavings. I want you to keep my dad safe at work. I, I want to keep to my mummy here. and daddy it's very safe, safe with safe. me. This. If he gets injured or like killed, we won't have a dad anymore. And then it'll be sad. The car for the, my dad. Because I love him a lot. We welcome intervention. We welcome intervention. We welcome intervention.